Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy BB27 here and welcome to my review of the new SML video, Junior the Truck Driver. This video was so good, man. I just, I want to say that first of all, this video is very, very good for once. It, it's been a while since we got a truly good video from Logan. And also, take that, okay? Anyone who, who fucking said, oh, Junior's not gonna have a birthday this year because Logan stopped aging the characters, take that in your fucking face. You're wrong. Junior's 16th birthday happened, and it was a great video, guys. It was amazing. <laughs> so basically, we're just gonna jump into it because this video has a lot going on. Um, the plot recap is that it's Junior's 16th birthday, which, again, I knew Logan wasn't gonna forget. Everyone, oh, Logan forgot, or he's not aging them. No, he wasn't gonna forget. This video's great. Anyways, yeah, so it's his birthday, and, um, he's hoping his dad gets him, like, this fancy Corvette or whatever, and Joseph and them are like, oh, you're not gonna get that, dude. So then they go outside and, oh, voice crack. <laughs> They go outside and um, Bowser or, you know, Braxton got him uh, the big rigs and like the fucking giant semi truck, which I, I don't know if they bought this. I guess they bought this for the whole video. I wonder if it's going to become like a thing they use. Maybe they just like somehow like they rented it or something. But um, so he gets this giant semi truck and immediately he drives off and it's already three months later and he's a full blown truck driver. And this kind of begins like the main parts of the video where a lot of the humor is the truck driving jokes like and if people don't like that you're probably not gonna like this video a lot but for me I find it hilarious there's so many references in here to how truck drivers live and their wives and just how they never see them and all this shit that's going on, on the road like there's so many good jokes in here um, and I could definitely see some people not liking this episode just because they may not understand the humor. With me, I actually understand it quite a bit. Even like the gas, the Love's Gas Station reference, like I got that. And I know there's just a lot of good references and jokes in here. But basically, yeah, he's on the road for months. Um, there's a part where he's like, I guess like Brooklyn guy's mom is trying to hit on him. That part's pretty funny. It's kind of gross, but it's pretty funny. Uh, and then he goes back on the road. And there's a part with Brooklyn guy, which I thought was going to suck at first I actually thought that's when the video would start getting crappy but it actually was really funny because he goes and he's trying to see what's in the truck you know what he's hauling and they open up the door and and all these Mexican people start running out which I thought was really funny um it's, it's something Logan usually wouldn't do is just like I don't know there's something about the humor in this episode it just doesn't feel like something Logan would do it feels more something like SMLYTP would do but uh, yeah, Logan did it, and it's just great. There's a lot of good stuff in here. So after that, um, he eventually goes back to the house to you know check up on his wife and his friends. And but by the way, he's married to Penelope now because he's a truck driver, and she's become fatter than him. So we basically get introduced to Fat Penelope, which I thought was hilarious. And then he's trying to hit her because it's like there's this whole vein. I'm not gonna explain it, but it's kind of funny. It's like a whole joke about how they can hit their wives. And they basically like rub their bellies together and fall over like some sumo wrestlers type shit. And um, that that part's really good. That whole part's really good. It, it goes on a little bit longer than I'd like. It's a little bit of like a red couch scene, but it's really funny. Uh, so after that, he goes back on the road and then he's getting tired. Uh, the whole time there's this dude over the speaker that sounds kind of like Goofy, which I'm not sure if it's a reference to him because Goofy was a character at one point in the channel's history and he kind of sounded like that. But um, I think it's just supposed to be a redneck truck driver guy on the speaker, but he's pretty funny. So basically it leads to, um, what is it? He, yeah, he crashes because he's like, you know, basically has a heart attack and he crashes the whole truck. And that part's kind of funny because it just goes to like a black screen while everything's like crashing. He's killing all these people. <laughs> so he wakes up in the hospital. Brooklyn guy tells him about what just happened. And then he's like making some good jokes in there. Penelope comes in and then they fight again and fall over. So... Yeah, that's basically the whole plot recap. Sorry if it's a bit messy. There is just so much happening in this episode, and it's all so funny. It's so creative. It's so different. It's what I've been asking for from Logan, and I don't want to get my hopes up too much, because although this is a very good start to October, 
I know that this is probably not going to last, and considering it's a birthday video and it's just supposed to be special, I'm kind of have to just give it the birthday pass. Like, obviously it's going to be a more special, highly effort video, right? You know, kind of how Jeffy's birthday was or previous junior birthdays. Um, so I can't, like, I can't, I'm not going to be like, oh my god, October's going to be amazing, guys, because I still don't really have high hopes after last month, but I'm hoping... I am hoping that this kind of maybe, you know, sparks Logan to do some more creative stuff because this video had a lot of green screen stuff in it, had a lot of good jokes, it had a lot of different things going on, and I just found it all hilarious. So I think I'm going to have to go, I think I'm going to have to go 9 out of 10 on this one, guys. It is really good. It's not perfect, but it's pretty close and you could say i'm overrating this a bit but i found everything hilarious there was a couple bits that maybe dragged on a little bit longer than they needed to but for the most part i have no negatives with this video i have no you know criticisms really maybe they could have done a little more i guess in the truck itself but i don't know i think this was great and i really do hope they bring back the truck again because that that's an interesting location it's kind of like when they had the school bus so for uh, you know a time period so, um, yeah, great video, very funny, a lot of good references, and, I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed it, too, because, I, again, I know this video is probably going to be a mixed one for a lot of people, but I thought it was creative and funny, so, yeah, that's about it. I'm going to stop yapping. <laughs> like, subscribe, it's your boy, Blader, let me know what you guys thought, and, uh, good job, Logan. You, you know, people think I'm an SML hater, but... I'm not like I will praise Logan when Logan does good and that's this is a good example of it he did good so you know good job nine out of ten all right that's about it peace out and stay lit